Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Cardboard Therapy. I am Dell, and I am weak. I know in a previous video I said I was done buying packs for a while with the Lord of the Rings set, and in my adventures, right after making that, I found a bundle. And I thought to myself, is it worth the price? Then I started looking at it, and I'm like, well... Maybe. Comes with each of these, from what I understand. And the one ring being itself up there in price still. I said, yeah, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to get these. Comes with some other stuff too that we'll see as it crack open. I'm not happy with myself. I am pretty broke at this point. Having just come back from Baltimore, having paid some bills, having bought some other stuff, so other stuff happening, and then here I am justifying another purchase. But, maybe this will be worth it, maybe I'll pull something cool. Who knows? So we're going to put that off the side. Uh, ooh, I'm excited already. has a little insert. Tree beard on one side and no foot guy in this. Is that tree beard too? So we saw it in the other video. Usually there's like a, a title there. That looks, I like I like this side. This might end up in the frame too, because that's just really pretty. But what can't go in a frame is the deck box itself or the long box. Let me zoom out. This is really nice. This is gonna be in my collection for a while now. I'm going to keep that for a long time. And we got Galadriel and Sauron. Interesting choices there. Oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Hold up. I think our luck's already changing. It's supposed to be. Oversized spin down, right? Oh, it picks up on camera. It's supposed to be, it looks like white. Did we pull the. Thank you for focusing in the last second. I think we pulled the uh, Chase dice. Doesn't look the same. I've seen pictures of this for the previous kits, but that's pretty cool. Might be a sign of our luck changing, perhaps. How many packs do we have? I love that these come with little small boxes. I've been using those a lot more than the other ones now. There's <clears throat> eight packs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got nine packs here. Yeah, it's supposed to come with eight. So we got the chase dice, we got an extra set booster, we got, I think just regular, regular basics, but this one has a card in it. This one, well I guess it should have the cards we discussed previously. Whoa. Yeah, I really need to organize the set better. Okay, yeah. So it has the four, like connector cards. Those two go on the top. These two on the bottom. I've pulled this. I think I pulled the other ones. Have not pulled the one ring. So I did it. I got the one ring. Not the one everyone else wants, but you know what? I'm happy with this. There's a way to like frame these together maybe. I don't know. These might just end up in my binder as is. But uh, let's put my stuff over here. <laughs> Foil basics too, right? These are pretty nice. These might end up going into some decks coming up. Uh, not much to say on that. I'm still jazzed about having the one ring finally. Pulling this and then an extra, extra pack to top it all off. So 
Let's see if we pull anything good in the packs. Will that be something worth seeing too? I hope. So I love set boosters better than all the rest of the packs. A little Spiegel art. Or uh, where is it going with that? I don't know. I like the good blend of just regular stuff you get from the set we've already seen a thousand times. Putting it out of the set because that's a card can use. Legendaries as well. We got a Gimli counter of kills. Uh, I'll finish the thing after this. Last March of the Ents, Saradoc. And I don't think we've seen this guy yet. He looks new. Haven't really looked through the commander decks too much either. Just kind of shuffle through just to look for interesting things. And I don't know. But I like opening set boosters more than collector boosters. One, because they're cheaper. And two, you used to pull some really nice stuff in there. What is this? Fog of the Barrow. I feel like we've seen that card a bunch, but I don't really look too close at the actual art. Bulk, bulk, bulk. Long list of the ants. I'm going to keep that on the side. Just Restoration, Lash of the Balrog. I think we might have seen before. Last. Oh, this. Am I losing my mind? The Battle of Bywater. Uh, the last video I made, I think I talked about not buying more. And then here I am opening more. And I'm still seeing some stuff that I don't recognize having opened a decent amount, but not a crazy amount. But also, my memory is not the best. The Legolas, yeah, Legolas counter of kills. Basic. Ooh, happy to get these. I think these are going to go up in price. I really hope they don't, because they're useful in the token deck. That I really need the value of this card to be low. But I'm going to keep putting them off this side until then. Grima, I think it's going to be worth a little bit. Ereth, same. Emer is just legendary. Got Gothmog, got Knights again, we got Goldberry, I like this card, and Pippin's Bravery. That's four. Ooh, we got a list card in this one. Is it something cool? Hope so. Is that Smaug? That's just a regular dragon. Yeah, Cavern Horror Dragon, nondescript Smaug. Full art. Swamp. Claim it. Precious, Black Breath, Urkai Berserker, Mordor Trebuchet, Rush the Broom, Quick Beam, oop, Start Imp, one of the Eagles, another one of the Eagles, Peregrine Took, King of the Earthbreakers, Nasty End. Again, really, I think I pulled one of these before, and really like the foiling on this, but also. For the longest time, I thought this was a different card. I thought this was something about destroying creature, but actually pretty good. Really good ability. I had to build my uh, card draw deck a little differently just for this card. That's how much I liked it. Yeah, an Ancient Spider. Not familiar with this card, but kind of bummed it's not black-green, because I have a black-green spider deck. But I see there's like a little bit of theme there. A spider card being a list card. Is there something more to that? Like more Lord of the Rings themed reprints for that spot. We got Aragorn. Really pretty art. King of Gondor. Basic. Oops. Protector, Aaron Ryder, Stalwarts, Inherited Envelope. Grand. Another one of those little cards that I just enjoy seeing. Orcs. Ooh, have I pulled this yet? Oh, I do like this. It's a nice art and interesting ability. Display of power. Interesting. I think this is worth a little bit. Seems pretty good. Ents Fury and then the ring. Tempting card. About halfway, got four packs left. Pretty, pretty buzzed about uh, just the initial impression of getting this box. Extra pack. 
Pretty sure that's the rare dice. I don't know. Captain is a win. Elrond, right? Really nice art for that. Kind of zoomed in funny. That's the one that comes in the, uh, the circle. But nothing too crazy besides the uh, initial pull of the ring that we knew was going to be in here. Shire Sheriff. Don't like it. Rock the cash bar. Just more stuff we've seen. Not left, much left to say on this. I know we're not going to pull anything bonkers. Being the Seppus, we're not going to pull the one ring, of course, because I think they're only in collector boosters. I do have a list card in this one, too. I wanted to peek. Ooh, soul ring. Is that one of the old rings? Treason, War Beast, Orx, Legendary. I'm plot off this side too, as long as you. Speculation, right? Samwise, Saradoc, we just saw you. And I said that I don't think I've seen you before. Got a watcher in the water here. And Boo, another Ollie font. What's our list card? Nile spin bomb. Boo. Depends ultimate pack. One more after this. Let's see a list card in this. Bit of a bummer. Another I wanna say Aragorn, but I knew it wasn't Theodine. Theoden. That, got that, got that, got that. Eowyn. Pretty book. That was on a fair mirror. Uh, this seems interesting. Oh, we got a full art for Nasty, and I still like the other one I have already. But this looks kind of fun. Ooh, we got Rivendale. I think we have this already. I think we have the full art. This looks kind of nice, too. Oath of the Grey Host. And Garbage Token. Last pack. What do we got in here? If I can get the damn thing open. Now, I'll say this too. Now, I think I'm done for a bit. <laughs> buying, buying packs at least. But you know, name of the channel. Cardboard Therapy. Uh, it's a different green one I've seen before. Another Foil Mountain. That seems to be another one I keep seeing. But we'll see. It's definitely going to be a little bit longer because it's hard to find these in the wild. I'm definitely not going to buy them online. Ooh, Elven Chorus. I think we've seen this once before. It's useful. And not as useful. And then a boo. Well, that's all, folks. I'm going to pull out the uh, reason for the season here. Just look at it again. It's kind of nice to have it. Now, is there any deck this is really good in for me? Not really. Because these go together there. And they touch it. There's not really much in the bottom there to really draw them together, but it looks pretty cool. But more than anything, this is the price of admission here. Didn't pull much craziness that I could tell. Again, saying that with not the greatest. Uh, uh, what's the word? I can't think of it. Assuredness. Oh, is that the word I'm looking for? I don't know. There might be something crazy. Or somebody in the comments probably yell at me about, like, oh, how are you crazy? That 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 card's worth a bunch of money. But at this point, I think I've seen enough to be like, oh no, nothing that good, huh? Oh well. I like the little insert here. Come on. I think about saving that. Drill too. Well, won't put that in the recycling quite yet. But start cleaning up. Find a little thing for this as well. I like this. It's nice. I like, I like the little stuff. I used to the fat pack posters used to collect a lot. It used to be all over my list. I still have a couple left. The real special ones for me, but they get this one. They don't want to waste paper like that. They'll put other crap. In. I don't know. Kind of rambling now. At the end of the, end of the video. I know how to end it, but 
just to get in there. But uh, we'll see what else comes in the coming weeks. I have some tech deck, deck tech blank that maybe. Oh, I want to start the video over now. Just stuttering like that at the end. We're stammering. A couple uh, deck techs coming up. And some other content planned. Uh, going to do a big crossover episode with some friends. Going to record that later next month. But it's probably going to be like more inexpensive videos to shoot. Plan on making a new uh, background here too. i got some stuff planned for that in the near future. But as you can see, nothing quite came to fruition yet. Uh, beyond that, been a good weekend. I'm recording all these pretty much the same day, like literally after I record the other videos. Uh, I went out to get some stuff, get some groceries. Happened across the bundle, and I'm like, dang it, bought it. Literally right after I said I wasn't buying anymore, but here we are. I'm just reiterating myself now, I'm just kind of mad at myself. But, it's how I feel, not how much I make, right? Is that, is that how they say it? Anywho... I will see you soon enough. Probably not with cardboard theory, like I said, but soon enough. Maybe I'll have some other stuff planned. I don't know. I'm just figuring out. Just doing it as I go for fun. But as always, I really appreciate you guys watching. And until next time, love you.